cross. Put the cross right next to it. everybody. Thanks for coming out. Uh, I'd like to welcome you and I'm going to pass it right over to retired Memorial uh, Firefighter Jordan Levine. Afternoon. As you see, we got the 9-11 flag. Okay. This is not the iconic one that you saw the three uh, firefighters raising that day. Okay. This was brought down, placed in the rubble between Tower 1 and Tower 2. It remained in place for a search until November 2nd, 2001, when a, uh, a cadaver dog got a hit that there were remains under it. It was removed then and shipped overseas with a tin from Barnes. From there, it flew a couple of sorties in admissions, and then it went to uh, SEAL Team 6 and ID 450, I think they were called. They were the guys that got uh, Saddam out of the hole. So it was there on scene when that came out. Um, it's been all over, you know, the world, basically. Uh, from here, we'll go to Greenfield tomorrow. Uh, okay, let me back up a little bit. We picked it up in West Stockbridge. Uh, West Stockbridge, Northampton, Springfield, Barnes, Blanford, Southampton, Boyle. And now here. Tomorrow, it will go to Greenfield. We'll go take possession of it for the night. We'll pick it back up. It goes to Burning Stick. That's where Run for the Fall in New England starts, which is a 153-mile uh, run. It starts in Burning Stick or across Mass into uh, Vermont, New Hampshire, and then Sunday, Kittery, Maine. The flag will be on a pole carried by a runner at all times, unless inclement weather. This flag does not get wet. So if it starts raining, you see me panic. Oh well. Um, and then uh, in Maine, I believe it's Fort Carlson, which is right on the coast. Somebody will take it, step one foot in the Atlantic, and step back. It is now going coast to coast, from the Pacific to the Atlantic Ocean. The run used to be done just across the different runners. Now they're making it into a, uh, a divisional thing. So this is New England's. You know, when you come up and you look at it, please put gloves on. Not so much, you know, the, the uh, stripes, but the stars and the white border with signatures. They're going back and, yep, SEAL Team 6 is on there, all under code, so you'll never know who they are. And uh, ID 55 or 45 is also on there. Uh, Barnes is on there, places it's flown in Iraq. And uh, that's about it. The cross, I'm sorry, I always forget the cross. There's a chunk of marble that was removed from 9-11 from the trade centers and someone carved out the cross and that's been traveling with it ever since. So, you got questions, fire away. Oh, that was <laughs> <laughs> But, uh, you know, come up if you want pictures, let us know. We got, you know, I got no problem doing pictures with it. You think of something? All right,